I would say that so many Thai people think of their identity as a Thai person, to be Thai is to be Buddhist. So they often think that if they change their religion, that means they're changing their whole culture. So when we present the gospel, they often think, oh, the Christianity comes from America or it comes from Europe. And so we have to really work hard to let them see that it doesn't really matter where they're from or where we're from, the gospel is not about their culture, it's about Jesus. And so we really do our best to present Jesus who he is and to make it clear that it's not about their culture, it's not about ours, but let them see that they can be transformed completely without giving up being Thai, without giving up their Thai-ness. They can still do a lot of Thai traditional things in life, they can still be Christian and Thai at the same time. Thai people really want to study English because they know that if they can speak good English, they can get a good job in Thailand with an international company or they could move overseas to any English speaking country and have a good job and immediately that's going to improve their financial status and they'll be able to help their family which is a major part of their culture is helping their family and their parents. So when they can learn English they see it as a way that they can, it's a sort of a meal ticket, it's a way out. And so when we provide English classes they are so excited to study especially with a native speaker. I've had people come up to me on the street and say can you teach me English? Can you teach my son English? English. And so when we offer a really discounted price with native English speaking teachers, they are quick to jump on the opportunity and they're quick to come to church actually and study English. Success in my mind would look like not only for people to come to Christ because I want that more than anything else in the community where we serve, but our community where our church is is actually a government housing projects area and so a lot of lower income families live there and I would like to see families transformed. I'd like to see the parents of the children we minister to come to Christ and see the drug problems in that area obliterated, to see women who used to work in the sex industry come out of that and to meet Jesus. I would really like to see the whole community transformed and become a place where um, God is praised and where families are close and tight-knit.